The first step into the so-called real world is moving out of your parents' house. Up until now, my responsibilities were to eat my greens and to go to bed on time, and even that I still struggle to do. The brave ones move out earlier, and others it may never happen at all. For me, it's happening today. At 22 years old, I'm officially moving out. I never really liked the city. My only memories of it was moving my sister's stuff from one apartment to another. She moved every year for 10 years. Times Square was loud, the air smelled like cigarettes, and it all seemed chaotic. But in the past two years, the city started to call me. It started with CZ, then Kelly, and for the past year, I've been taking the four hour commute back and forth to New York City for work. And you know what's funny? Times Square is still loud. The air still smells like cigarettes, and it still is chaotic. But that's what part of being a New Yorker is. No one is here to settle, everyone is chasing something, and the more I find myself here, the more it starts to feel like home. Don't get me wrong, I love my home. It's safe, my family's there, my friends are there. All that I've ever known is there, but my dreams are here. It's kind of some stars all aligned type stuff, but towards the end of 2022, my two friends' leases were ending, and they were looking for a third roommate. Within three weeks of meeting up, we had found an apartment that checked off most of our boxes and the next thing I knew, we put pen to paper. Today is a very exciting day. After over a year of taking the train, I'm finally moving to the good old New York City. I'm gonna be moving with two, two of my friends. So it's gonna be really fun, I'm really excited. Right now I'm on my way to sign the actual lease. I can't believe this is happening. I've been wanting to move to the city for so long and it's cool that I'm finally doing it. I had signed my first ever lease to a shoebox for 14 months 14 with my months. friends and now roommates, Tejas and Truman. What am I doing now? <laughs> this is gonna be our home. 14 months, baby. 14, 14 months. months. It's gonna be a fun year. Like, this is the start of a really cool story. I like it. I like it a lot. I do like it. There's something homey about it. We just found a cockroach. Thanks. Go show him. That's New York though, right? I don't know. Oh! oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I hate you. I, I saw that coming too. So today is move out day and I can't believe it, but I'm finally moving out. I've lived here for about 17 years of my life. I'm 22 years old, so I guess I'm old enough to make my own decisions now and pay my own bills. This is the current state of my room. It is actually a disaster and I have one hour until I have to get going to move. I don't know if that's possible, but I guess let's just get started. Dude, this is the this is the first day of the rest of your life. The first day of the rest of our lives. I'm so behind on packing. Oh, here's my my childhood teddy bear. His name is Teddy. Here, I'll let him take over the vlog. All right, Teddy, you're in charge of the vlog. Careful, camera's pretty heavy. Oh my God, this thing is fucking heavy. Um, hi guys. As you heard, the boys are moving out. It can be scary. Saying goodbye to your friends and family. Sorry, a new chapter in your life, but change is good. And a new place is a great opportunity to reinvent yourself. No one knows who you are, so you can be whoever you want to be. I heard Colt saying something about being a YouTuber, so I guess that's what he's going to be. I still got to figure out what I want to be. Maybe an astronaut. A teddy bear astronaut. That could be cool. All right, thanks for the B-roll. I'm not done yet. Me back no, 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 no. I'm still talking. Hey. All right, we made it to New York City. I'm gonna miss you hanging out on my couch every like three days. But... Well, I, I appreciate all that you've done. Hey, gotta start somewhere, buddy. Good luck, man. Thank you. You did it! I'm so proud. Thank you. Could be a hell of a lot worse, trust me. How's it going? Good morning! Oh! What's up, oh! Rudy? <laughs> hey, man, rent's due. Well, it's nice to see you too. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mess. It's a mess. Ugh. This is Shervin. Moving in is a process. Oh yeah, I gotta set up my room now. Oh, me too, dude. All right, so this is the current state of my room. Pretty clean. Not on that side, but now we get to set everything up. This is where my bed's gonna go. Literally, I feel like it's gonna come out to like here maybe. So then I have like not that much space left for my room. But it's okay. I guess there's nothing to it but to do it. So let's get started. Yeah, we got it. Look 
to my rug. Boom! We have a bed now. Wow. So nice. So now I'm gonna set up my desk. When planning out the space, it's not that big. So I decided to go with this like folding desk slash shelving thing in my room. So I went with the Ikea Ivar. I don't know. We'll see how it looks. Low key, my bed takes up half the space already. So a little concerned, but whatever, I guess. Piece of cake, I think. That's what we're working with. Let's go! Finally, that literally took all day. Oh, this looks sick! Look at you, Bob the Builder. Yeah, right? Dude, this took way too long. I need to eat food. <laughs> and dude, look at these shots, ready? Look at it. This is the main reason I got this thing. This, this slidey thing. Oh, didn't see you guys in there. That took way too long, but I got the desk and the bed done today. I'm gonna save the rest for another day because I have to eat and I have to do my job. So, to the next day. I mean, how cool is that? Anyways, it's been about a week since we moved in and let me catch up to speed and show you the current set of the room. So I built this desk and actually it's been pretty cool. I like it a lot and it even folds up out of the way. You can push that in and then this whole thing collapses and boom, fun space back. This is nice because now the room feels a lot bigger even though it's a pretty tiny hallway. And yeah, with these French doors open, I feel like I'm in the master bedroom. So in terms of clothes, I've been hanging my jackets and stuff on these hooks that were already here. And then I just have my clothes in these boxes and suitcases underneath my bed. So right now that is a temporary solution. So today I'm looking to tackle this mess over here and basically build this rail system that Ikea has and it's like an open closet design instead of a big bulky dresser. All right, let's start with the setup. I think I drove with a brick. Oh no, this is not going anywhere. Oh my God, that literally took so long, but now we can have fun. Build a wardrobe. I've learned to uh, not underestimate Ikea, that's for sure. But we're having fun, right? Having fun. So this is the final thing built. Got three drawers to put my clothes in. They all slide out. A shelf, I can buy more shelves if I want, but then we can hang things right there. What do you think, Tages? Dude, your room is coming together so well. Thank you, man, thank you. The apartment's coming together. Sorry, it's a little loud. But dude, this is great. My room is like, it's feeling like a home. Nice, nice, nice. All right, Tages just, just made us dinner. We're on this like fold out table that Shervin had. We're calling ourselves the content closet. So this is the content closet yeah. crew. <laughs> Our goal living together was to finally make it, to create an environment where we share the same goals and dedicate a year to becoming YouTubers. I've always wanted to be a creator and the recent growth of my channel gives me hope that I might just get there. It's finally happening and my once dreams are now becoming a reality. I'm gonna miss those late night train rides, getting home late, and asking around to see whose couch I could crash on. It definitely was humble beginnings, but we all gotta start somewhere, and now it's time for new beginnings. So, welcome to the content closet, where hopefully in a year from now, we can afford more than just a closet.